Okay, one of the things I love about BlueKit, and this is I, the free version. So you can see right here, here are my sets that I've created so far. You can see if I click here, um, it's gonna tell me that I have to upgrade to get that feature. So I am just using the free version. Okay, again, um, you could totally help me out. Uh, it would be awesome if when you join, you click add a refer and enter my username, which would be Mrs. No Space Jenkins. Now see, I can't for myself, but you can, so thanks. All right, so let's go back to my dashboard and let's look at history, okay? So you can see these are the times I've deleted some of them, but these are the ones that we've done. So when you have the free version, this is what you're gonna see. How many people played, how many right answers, wrong answers, Okay, if you upgrade again, you're going to get a detailed report, but I just want to show you what I can see in the free version. And for me, this is enough because I sometimes do two or three quick blue gets during class and I pick one of them to grade for participation. So I'm just checking if students are doing what they're supposed to. So you see, I can see all of their names. I can see how many questions they attempted and how many they got right. Okay, so super quick super simple way to gauge participation. And my students don't know on any given day if I'm gonna check the first, the middle, or the last, if I use three. Sometimes I only use one, sometimes I might use two, but they don't know which one I'm gonna grade for participation. So it's been awesome for keeping them engaged and it's fun.